This video outlines the free procurement project and the totally free version of SpendMap that automates purchase orders and a whole lot more. You can learn more about the project and the free software at free-procurement.com. Okay, the most common question that we get is whether or not the software is truly free. So for the record, this is totally free software. It's not just a demo or a limited version, there's no limit on the number of users or suppliers or items or transactions, and it'll never time out. If it works for you, you can use it forever for free. While there are no restrictions and everyone is welcome to use the free version of SpendMap, it was designed for small companies and we offer other products and services that are more suitable for larger organizations. First and foremost, the free version of SpendMap is a Windows desktop application that needs to be installed on each user's PC. This usually isn't a problem for a handful of users, but if you have a large user community, the web-based version of SpendMap will be better for you to avoid having to install software on each computer. As far as functionality goes, we're advertising the free version of SpendMap as free purchase order software, but it actually does quite a bit more than that. In addition to automating your purchase orders, you can keep track of the status of your orders, you can keep track of your spending by cost center, or department, or project, you can keep track of your budgets, and you can manage your suppliers and items and other master file data. There are many built-in reports to keep an eye on your spending, and we've also included the receiving modules so you can keep track of which shipments have come in and which you're still waiting for. We've also included the email integration module so you can email your purchase orders to your suppliers directly from the system. To learn more about other modules that you can add at any time, just click on these icons or these hyperlinks. Okay, when you download the free version of SpendMap, you'll get a group of icons like this on your desktop and in your start menu. It's best to start by taking a quick look at the Getting Started documentation, which reviews important things like how to install the system on your network for multi-user access, how to get help if you need it, and most importantly the Getting Started documentation provides tips and tricks for how to best go about implementing the system. Next, you'll notice these three icons for your evaluation, live, and testing copies of SpendMap. You don't need to use all three systems if you don't want to, but we've set up each one to perform one of three specific tasks that most people go through when they implement systems like this. The evaluation copy of SpendMap is the exact same software as the live copy that you'll actually use to run your business, except that we've preloaded it with a bunch of sample data so you can evaluate and learn the software without having to configure the system from scratch. So in the evaluation copy, you'll see these sample items and suppliers, as well as some sample requisitions and purchase orders and other transactions that you can play around with to get a feel for what your system will look like if you decide to implement SpendMap. So go ahead and play around with your evaluation copy and don't worry about making a mistake. That's exactly what the evaluation copy is there for. When you're ready to actually implement SpendMap in your business, fire up the live copy and run the setup wizard. The wizard will take care of the basic configuration for you, so you'll be able to start processing your purchase orders in just a few minutes. The setup wizard will take care of things like setting up your bill to and ship to address, what you want your incrementing PO numbers to be, you can select from a series of templates for your purchase orders and other documents, and you can even upload your logo that will show at the top of each order. Your testing copy is completely optional. You may have no need for it, and the evaluation copy with its sample data might be enough for you when you need to do some testing or learn some new features. But if you ever want to test something that might be affected by the data or settings in your live system, the testing copy lets you make a mirror image of your live system to be sure that whatever you test will perform in exactly the same way once it's in production. Again, this is totally optional, so please don't feel obligated to use your testing copy if you don't want to. In addition to some pretty cool free software, we also put together a whole set of resources to help you get the system going. In addition to a great online help system and our YouTube channel that has a whole bunch of video tutorials to help you get started quickly, you can also log a free support ticket to get your specific questions answered quickly. To learn more about the free procurement project or to download your free copy of SpendMap, just check out our blog at free-procurement.com.